What's up guys, it's Beyond the Average here and we're just gonna jump straight into the video guys. So if you're a beginner trader, right, like myself, you know, I started trading January to, and it's now what, November, right? So I still say I'm a beginner trader, you know, we've learned a lot throughout this whole entire year. But one thing that I was running away from guys, and I'm gonna go straight to the video, I'm gonna tell you what it is, is backtesting guys. So if you're a beginner trader and you're not backtesting, you don't truly want it after all. Because you have to go sit down on the boring charts, right? If if you find the charts boring, and just and just replay your model, replay your model, replay your model at the exact same time you would have taken in in a real account, right? And just keep doing that back and forth, back and forth. And guess what that's doing for you and your emotions and and, and your eyes? It's training your eyes first of all to spot your model as soon as it appears, right? And it's also training your discipline. Uh, basically training your discipline right to be able to wait for for the for the model to appear to be able to sit there patiently waiting for something uh that's going to give you the confluence right to be able to enter that trade and that's basically what it does and it's something that i've been running away from and i've always realized and wondered why every time i enter the market there's always going to have a lot of emotions going on every time i see my setup i have a lot of doubts trying to enter right why because i wasn't doing a lot of back testing because i'm like damn what if it fails now, since I've been doing a lot of backtesting, now I can just enter, and if he fails, I'm like, okay, shoot, okay, cool. Let me just go hit hit the books again and backtest some more, right? And if he fails, okay, all models fails. Not, not, there's not a single model that's just like perfect, 100% win rate, right? And if anybody's telling you that, then they're just lying to you, right? So that's just something that I have to, I can, I don't know how to stress it enough, is that, enough is that if you're a beginner trader, fall in love with backtesting, man. Fall in love with backtesting. It's gonna get you a, a, a long way. Get you a long way. Don't don't listen to anybody that be like, oh, don't I don't backtest. I don't backtest. No, right. You gotta follow the 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 right the right steps so that way we can be able to become even like profitable and stuff. So where we can be able to hit our goals, right? By going into and finding a model and then going and watching it play back to back in backtesting. I use um uh I use FX replay for mine. And you can also use like the same one, right? So that's why I use every single day when I do my back testing. And it has helped me so much. Right. And now I feel very confident going into like real markets and stuff. I feel like I can be able to just like go in, get what I needed, and boom, I'm out. And now also it helps you to know, okay, during these market conditions, I should not be demanding so much into uh, from the markets, right? It's it shows you all these different things. It's better you find out during back testing, right? And you didn't even lose any money and you and you correct it rather than finding out in your live account or, or in your funded account and losing and going into drawdown right then you're like oh, okay i should not do that no more and that's why back testing is very important right i'm gonna make this video short i hope a lot of y'all take this information very seriously and actually start doing this thing if you don't believe me just try it just try for a month I'm just back testing, back testing your model, back testing whatever strategy that you're using, and then come back to me and, and let me know how you feel after that. Like a lot of the doubts that's if you had let's say 80% doubt every time you enter the market, that's probably gonna go down to five to all the way down to like 40%. And I'm just being honest with you, right? So the it, as soon as you're done watching this video, go out there and start back testing back to back to back. I promise you it's gonna help you big time. Because I am in basically in the same situation as some of y'all, right? I started trading here in January and I can see tremendous, tremendous like changes, right? And when as soon as I start back testing my strategy, as soon as I start testing out what I what I was doing into the market, like outside of like the live accounts or like evals, or whatever, I started seeing a lot of changes. So whenever I go back to my my eval or funded accounts, right, guess what? It's just gonna be cake. Because I know what to do, what not to do, because I've already learned those lessons for free. Just like how ICT says, right? Like you literally learn learning those lessons for free. With, and it doesn't cost you anything, but you just have to backtest it, right? So that's uh, just, just something that I hope this video helps somebody out there. And I hope you, you build that habits. And I hope you just started, you start, you jump into backtesting as fast as you can. So that way you can get used to used to seeing that model play out your eyes you can train your eyes seeing that every single time as soon as you your eyes sees it boom there you go let me enter boom right every single time right so anyways and also one thing that you can also see is you can see how long it how long how many wins you get when it fails and also you can also just see overall like okay how many losses can i be able to take 
right? And also you can test out your risk management and see how well I can, how well my risk needs to be in order to be able to to end up blowing an account or just going or just you know, let's say getting out of drawdown too or to get into drawdown, right? You can test all those different things out, and that's why it's very good. Uh, to be able to do the the back testing, I'm thinking about I'm probably gonna start doing like live back testing where I just go live on my TikTok, on YouTube, right? I just go live and then just start back testing on the weekends or something like that. I don't know if y'all if y'all like that, let me know and we can all and I can start doing that. So, anyways, I hope you guys have a good. Um, I hope you, I hope this video helps somebody and I hope you guys have a good day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.